Hello, I wanted to share a Halloween story that me and my kiddos love to read. It's Trick or Treat from New Jersey by Eric James and Carl West. The full moon's out on Halloween. The sky is starry bright. Above the state of New Jersey appears an eerie light. It darts behind the scattered clouds. It zips from town to town. It hovers over Jersey City then slowly heads on down. A ramp shoots out, a hatch appears, smoke pours into the air. A chilling alien silhouette gives owls and wolves a scare. It steps out of the thick white fog, its skin is neon green. This alien is without a doubt. the cutest thing I've ever seen. Welcome to New Jersey. Map of New Jersey, Princeton, Montclair, or Atlantic City. There's just so much to do. And what about Lake Marcia? But first, a trip to Cape May Zoo. He pulls out his transporter and waves it in the air. Now in the spot where he just stood, there is nobody there. He reappears in Trenton and wanders all around, making sure that he checks off each landmark that is found. Top five tourist spots, Cape May Zoo, New Jersey State Museum, Cape May Lighthouse, Maurice Pier Wildwood, Thomas Edison National Historic Park. He zaps onto New Brunswick to take a little look, snapping selfies as he goes and posting them to Facebook. But where is everybody? Are they staying in tonight? He climbs up high to take a peek and gets a nasty fright. For all around the spooky town, the streets are jammed and heaving. Monsters, monsters everywhere. It's time that he was leaving. I'd better run, the alien says. I'm not big a brave hero. Oh no, my gizmo doesn't work. The battery gauge reads zero. They're closing in. There's no escape. He scrunches up his eyes. The monster's all around him, but he gets a big surprise. Hey, high five, dude, the vampire shouts. Great costume, shrieks the ghoul. A little ghost tugs at his arm and says, I think you're cool. So you don't want to eat me then? The alien asks. They laugh until they're so red faced, they must take off their masks. Sweet antenna smiles the ghost. While giving them a flick, the children shriek what happens next is just the coolest trick. The jack-o'-lanterns all take off and float into the sky. Oh, wow, they gasp. It looks like you're a real life alien guy. Children dance excitedly, they shout, can you do more? The alien shows them lots of tricks as they go door to door. These antics impress everyone, which comes in really handy because it means before too long, their bags are filled with candy. It's getting late, I'd better go, the alien says at last. I promise I'll come back next year. New Jersey's a blast. 
They take him to a spaceship and say their sad goodbyes. They wait for him to start it up and zoom into the skies. But something isn't right because it makes the weirdest sound. The witch points underneath and asks, what is that on the ground? His spaceship has a fuel leak. There's thick goo everywhere. Oh, shucks, he says. It looks like I'm not going anywhere. The werewolf hands out bubble gum and shouts, come on guys, chew. We'll stretch the gum across the hole and stick it down like glue. What a good idea. We'll fill the tank with candy. We've got buckets of the stuff. Throw it in up to the brim. That should be just enough. Smart werewolf. The spaceship is now ready. The alien turns the key. The engine roars, the spaceship soars, and zooms off with a whee! But now it's diving back to Earth, and the children shake with fear. Ah! He's just flying past to wave and say, see you next year. Happy Halloween, New Jersey. The end.